Hi guys, back in with another video. Let me show you guys how to make the easiest and best coffee cake. First thing we're gonna do is cream the butter and sugar for the cake layer. So in goes a cup of softened butter. In goes a cup of white granulated sugar. Now we're just gonna mix it together until it's like super light and fluffy. Now with the butter and sugar cream, we're gonna start adding in some eggs. Now we're just gonna add eggs one by one and mix them thoroughly. Now we're just gonna put a cup of buttermilk, two teaspoons of vanilla extract. We're just gonna mix that up now. Now it's time to start adding the dry ingredients. So we have two and a half cups of all-purpose flour, straight in, a teaspoon of baking soda, half a teaspoon of baking powder, a pinch of salt. Now just mix it all together. Now I'm just gonna grease my baking pan real quick. So when you're done mixing, the batter should be pretty thick. So this is the cake layer and we're just gonna put it all into the pan. Now you just wanna spread this out evenly. Woo! Now we're gonna do the second layer. This is a four layer cake. Now it's time to make the cinnamon layer. In goes six tablespoons of butter, softened, a cup of dark brown sugar, a cup of all purpose flour, two tablespoons of cinnamon, now just mix, 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 mix. It's okay if there's a bunch of big granules and small ones, but that's it. Now I'm just gonna sprinkle the cinnamon layer over it. Bam! Pew. Now we're just gonna put that to the side and make the cheesecake layer. Into the bowl we have 16 ounces of cream cheese. Now like the first layer, we're just gonna mix this again until it's super fluffy. Now when it's super airy like this, half a cup of white sugar. Mix. Two eggs, one by one. Tablespoon of vanilla extract. So after it looks like that, now this is the cheesecake layer. Now we're just gonna pour this all over the second layer. Now just keep going back and forth until everything's covered. Now we're gonna make the final layer, which is the topping. Into my washed bowl, half a cup of white sugar, half a cup of brown sugar two tablespoons of cinnamon, a pinch of salt, half a cup or a stick of melted butter. Now we're just gonna add in two cups of flour. Bang, fourth layer of the cake. Now we're just gonna sprinkle a topping on it. It's okay if there's big and small pieces. Splash! That is the final layer. Into the oven at 350 degrees, we're just gonna bake this for 45 minutes. Y'all thought we were done? Nah, yo, it's time to make this glaze that goes on top when it comes out. So into the squeeze bottle, we're putting half a cup of powdered sugar. You don't even need a squeeze bottle, but I'm just doing it cause I have one. Two tablespoons of milk. A teaspoon of vanilla extract. Now all we gotta do is shake. Shake, 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 shake. Bang, and that is it your finished glaze. Let's go. Oh, oh, yo, dude, just right off the bat, the texture, dang, and there's like a whole inch of crumble. Oh my goodness, I'm messing it up. <laughs> Let's go! Yes, that crumb dang. cake. Super spongy, and the crumble got that really nice texture. All right, there's a spongy layer, for sure. The crumb. Dang, do you also put like a filling? Like a vanilla filling or something? Cheesecake layer, boy! Oh, yo! Mmm! Oh, but that's fire. I put a streusel with the glaze. Yeah, it, it reminds me of like pecan pie. Pecan pie. That's heated up. 
Dang, more fuego. Here, get a bite. Get a bite for y'all. Dude, that from is crazy. Alright, guys. You know the drill. <laughs> if you like the video, like that video! Make sure to like the, the video. <laughs> like that video. The best coffee cake you guys will ever taste. Try the recipe in the description below. And yeah, thanks for watching. Um, in the comments, please tell me the other things you guys want me to make below. And I'll try to make it. Coffee cake, let's see. Mmm! <laughs> Very good, good, good! <laughs>